the Great Pyramid app that we've used in class last week, and it was really great for note taking as a supplement. So the kids did some reading on Khufu's Great Pyramid, and then I was able to go into this app using the iPad and the Apple TV to project it up, and it allowed the students to manipulate themselves through the Great Pyramid that they'd read about. So when we talked about perspective, we were able to walk back and keep an eye on the camels and actually get a sense of just how great the Great Pyramid was. And they could pick different passageways that they wanted to navigate through. So we go into the Grand Gallery, and then you could actually walk through that area. We were able to take a bird's eye view tour, so they got a really good perspective on not only Khufu's pyramid, but his son Khafre's pyramid. This really tied in nicely with the other um, media we've been using last week, watching how the Great Sphinx was built, and just getting a concept of the pyramids and their architecture. And that was just an app that was purchased? Yes, yep, that was purchased through the Walt Computer Foundation. Um, in addition to the iPads and the Apple TV, there were iTunes gift cards included in the grant as well, and so that's allowed us to purchase this app and a lot of other content apps and presentation apps that might not necessarily be social studies related, but that we can apply um, to the curriculum. And how do you think the kids have responded? They love it. They can't wait any time I show them an app from the iPad or just utilizing it. Even the first day I used it just to do a slideshow presentation, they were so excited just to watch the slides go through on an iPad instead of a laptop. So it's created a whole new level of engagement and the kids, a lot of kids who might not normally be enthusiastic about participating are a lot more when they have the iPad to use. Awesome, thank you. Sure.